All right, all right, all right, Shalom. First and foremost, I'd like to give all praise and glory to Yahweh, Baal Shem, Yahweh Shai, Baal Shem, Waha, Rekai Kodash, and double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. It's the brother Yahweh coming at you with another lesson to edify and comfort the Lord's elect. So, Lord willing, that this video is edifying, comfort, and exhorting to you, brothers, whereas well you few sisters that listen and learn it. The year 2023, the hopeful year that all prophecies be fulfilled, and that's right. We pray and hope that all prophecies come to pass in the time that we're living in, all right, especially in these times. <clears throat> and I'm going to do a quick lesson on what I was speaking about at uh, the altar not too long ago, how we're going to desire, how the Lord's going to give us the desire to see the fall of our enemies, those who come up against us, those who scoff and scorn, all right, whether it be your family member, all right, whether it be your loved ones, all right, those who come up against you, these people in the world, and the Lord can give us the desire to see the fall of our enemies, man. All right. Those who have offended us. All right. Seek to harm us. And the Lord is going to give us power over these people. And we're going to see the desire of their fall. The Lord is going to give us desire to see their fall. All right. So this is Matthew 18 and verse <clears throat> five. It says, whosoever shall receive one such little child and my name receive me. It says, but whosoever shall offend one of these little ones who believe in me, it was better for him that, that a millstone were hanged about his neck that they were drowned in the depth of the sea. That's right. And we are the little children. All right. The prophets of the heavenly father. All right. Those who came and served, who, those who coming and serving the Lord with all truth and sincerity. All right. With fear and trembling. So those who come up against us, because the scripture speaks about scoffers coming in the latter days you know those who walking out to their own understanding seeking to harm us as they done in the ancient time to seek to kill the prophets those people here today to misuse the prophets all right and to offend the prophets they are here today but it's better for them all right to hang a millstone about their neck and drown in the depth of the sea if you offend one of the little ones that believe in how about shimao sha Okay, because why? We have the truth of Yahweh Bashimao Shah. We have the wisdom, knowledge, and understanding of Yahweh Bashimao Shah. And I don't write this out. We are of the elect, man. See, if you offend one of the little ones, all right, the elect, man, you got hell to pay. That's why I said at the altar, you better pray and hope that the men that you have been offended. The men that you come up against, you better hope and pray that we're not of the elect. Because we, we, if we are, man, you got hell to pay. All right? These people got hell to pay. You touching the apple of the most high's eye. All right? So you got hell to pay, man. Okay? And we're going to see the desire of our enemy. We're going to see the fall, man. We're going to see these people in, in, um, in great miseries. All right? We're going to laugh and mock you when your fear and the dread of Yahweh by Shema Shah come upon you. Let's grab that. And it's not going to be too long. It's quick through the spirit. This is Proverbs 1 and verse 24. It says, because I have called, because I have called and you refuse. I have scratched out my hand and no man regard. That's right. We have you. We have called unto you. We have piped unto you. All right. The Lord have piped unto you. He using us to call out. All right. To come out here and put in our bodies a living sacrifice. But the majority of our people, they refuse. It says, but ye have set at not at my counsel and would have none of my reproof. Jake don't want to be corrected. All right. You men, you women, you don't want to be corrected. But listen to this. It says, but you want to scoff and scorn. Okay. We're going to get the last laugh. All right. I also will laugh at your calamity. I will mock you when your fear comes. When the fear, when your fear come as desolation and your destruction come as a whirlwind, when distress and anguish come upon you. That's right, man. We're going to laugh. The Lord's going to laugh through us. Then shall they call upon me, but I will not answer. Then you're going to want to know the names. And those who know the names, you're going to call upon you. And the Lord's going to say, depart from me, for I never knew you. All right, you workers of iniquity. Then shall they call upon me, but I will not answer. They shall seek me early, but they shall not find me. For they have hated knowledge and did not choose the fear of the Lord. They will have, they will none of my counsel. They despise all my reproof. Therefore shall they eat. Of the fruit of their own way and be filled with their own devices. That's right, man. For turning away of simple shall slay them, and the prosperity of fools shall destroy them. But whosoever hearken unto me shall dwell 
dwell safely and shall be quiet from the fear of evil. All right. So, man, the Lord's got the Lord got these people. All right. The Lord got all you scoffing, you scorners, all you ones who offended us. All right. The time is coming right, when judgment is about to come and rain down. All right. And so with that, I pray the lesson was edifying, comforting, and exhorting to you, brothers. Where's your few sisters that listen and learn? And keep pushing, brothers. All right. Keep pushing, man. All right. We have the doorstep, man, to hell with these people. All right. Whether it be your family, man, your friends, anybody, you know, who come up against them, man, to hell with them. All right. Keep scribing. Keep pushing. All right. So with that, call Haloyim La Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shah, by Hashem Waha Rikakodash. A double honor to the Apostle Elder Great Millstone. Keep scribing, brothers. Keep pushing. We almost out of here. Shalom. Ababa